Hey, I'm Ben from Camp Chef, the makers of outdoor entertainment gear, the outdoor screen. Today we're going to show you how to how to uh, put together the outdoor screen. I've already gone through and removed my screen from the box, removed all the packaging. Now I got it in the bag ready to, to take with me, but I'm going to show you how to put it together. First off, we're going to pull this bad boy open. The uh, screen itself comes in a separate carrying case. So we'll just set that aside for now because we've got to put the frame up first. It also comes with stakes and your uh, guidelines for anchoring that up when, in case you need it for a wind or whatnot. We'll put those aside for now. Um, all the uh, pipes and all the come, come uh, set up here. And it's really pretty simple to do. All the pipes have letters on them. Um, we just go, we match letters to, le to letters. So A would go with A, B would go with B, C would go with C, and just start putting it together like a puzzle. If you kind of look at the, the picture on the package and know the just of what it's going to look like, um, then, uh, then you'll know how to do it pretty easily. But we'll first get all these out of the bag, and we'll go from there. Obviously, you got two pieces that are all the same, so if you keep you know, your pieces on one side and the other side, you're basically putting the two halves together. Now we can take the carry bag and just put that aside for now for when we put it back, take it back down. First off, we're going to take the A piece. The A piece is the top center piece. Um, the A piece then connects to the, to the angled pieces. One thing to remember here on the A piece, that we're lining up A to A, not A to B. A to B would make that thing way too small, but we're lining up A to A. So we're going to take A to A, connect it over here, and then we're going to take the other piece. Like I said, the left and the right are both lettered the same. We've got another piece that says A, so then we're going to take A to A. Now we're going to take, these, these sides have B's on them, so now we're going to take and find the two B pieces. So we have this piece, B, Connecting B to B. And then taking that same looking small piece, and we're going to connect B to B. As the alphabet, we all learned at a very young age. The next piece, C. Oh, look, there's a piece that says C. We're going to go C to C. And we're going to come on this side. C to C. Next we got D. D piece. D piece has got the piece off for the lower part of the screen. We're going to go D to D. And the same on this side, D to D. Next pieces are E. E is your cross piece, so we're going to go E starts coming into the inside. Same thing on this side, we're going to go E to E. And then our, our lower middle piece is the F piece. So same as the A piece, it has F's on both sides, and we're going to connect those F to F. You kind of have to pull these together here. Connect F to F. Now the only two pieces of the frame that we're left to, to uh, do are the uh, are the feet. The feet, rather than clipping together like the others, use a, a basic cotter pin, which will then put the, the feet on. For this next step, for putting on the feet, and then also putting on the screen, it's pretty crucial to have a second person come help you. So we're gonna have Tim come on and help us. Um, basically, these feet, like I mentioned earlier, um, you put the feet on with, with a cotter pin rather than the standard push buttons. So basically, all you have to do is slide up, slide in that cotter pin. Obviously, you want um, the leg, either you have a, a long piece or a short piece, depending on, on where you're going. If the wind's blowing at all, maybe you want the long piece uh, into the wind. Um, but then you just basically put that piece in, that cotter pin in and clip that like so. So the frame's all put together. Um, the next step, it's also very handy to have a, 
a friend or a, or somebody help you with is putting on the screen and stretching the actual screen up over the frame. Just pull the screen screen out of the bag. Um, the screen's obviously got a soft side and then obviously the white side. The white side's what you want facing facing forward. Just kind of unfold that like so. And then it's just it's just basically like a glove. So you're just going to take the frame and just slide it in to the frame. You kind of got to stretch it so you so you want to put it on nice and evenly. And then we're just going to slide it down. And just as easy as that, you know the screen's all put together. You got to make sure on these top corners that the uh, actual guide, the lines for the guides fit, come through that hole. Now we've, we've slid the screen all the way up over the top. Now we're just going to make sure you, you want to pull it down tight, tighten up that screen, and then you have these basic Velcro straps that hooked on the back side. We're going to turn around real quick so you can see. Basically all then you have to do is take these Velcro straps, slide them through these metal holes. Obviously, the, the straps have extra room for, for stretch, for different heat and whatnot. Um, you don't want to over tight them, but you do want them, you do want them tight enough that it's going to be tight so your screen's going to be for good viewing purposes. You're just going to keep going along, taking the Velcro. Maybe it'd do a little, be a little bit easier to do every other or so until you kind of get it stretched into place. So, so it's got plenty of straps there to adjust. Now we're going to turn around again, show you the, show you the front. See how we got this nice, taut uh, surface for, uh, for, for your viewing pleasure. Then like I mentioned previously, comes with uh, stakes and uh, guidelines. The guidelines hook up from the corner, you, you run that string through and then uh, guide it out to if you need to put it out. It's also got stake holes right here in the legs. If you just want to stake it down to the ground that you don't have any wind, you can just stake it straight down that way. So then when it gets dark, you're all set to go with the Outdoor Entertainment Skiers Outdoor Screen by the makers of Camp Chef.